Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about how I solder the wires onto the module. Uh, when I started soldering the first couple of wires over here, I just was I just put a blob of solder onto the pin. Then I discovered that by doing that, you're going to have a big blob of solder like this, and it may come in contact with each other. So if you can see in the latest wires, um, the solders is a little bit smaller and it's much cleaner. The trick is when you before you solder, you need to make a loop of the wire. Cut cut it long enough so that you can make a small loop. Uh, before you make the loop, you thin it with solder. Then after you make the loop, when you're ready to solder, you just put a little bit of solder in the hole of the loop. So as it solidifies, you, you have a blob of solder at the tip of your wire inside the loop. So when you're ready to solder it to the pin, what you do is you just heat it up a little bit and just, just slide down to the position that you want then you will then solidify and and then you can have this cleaner solder the other trick that I want to tell you is that as you know four of these wires have to go to one side and four to this side so the best thing to do when you loop it loop your wires into the pin is to um, pull it to one the side that you want to uh, pull the wire to later on. By doing this, you put in less stress on the the wires. And if you look at this, the reason also why I'm doing a a bend on the wire is that if you don't do it, you're going to pull the wire to this side and it's going to put a bit of stress on the wire, it may break the wire. So the best thing to do is just do a small bend and because you're going to uh, use the heat shrink to heat shrink everything up together, the heat shrink will hold this wire in place. I'm going to show it to you uh, soon. So I'll just take you around the, the solder ring. It's not pretty, but I think it will do the job. But if you just follow my tips for uh, soldering the wires onto the pin, uh, using the loop and the solder in, in between the loop, then you get a nicer solder. And to prevent the wires touching each other, the best thing to do is because the pin is quite long what you can do when you solder you can put in different position on on the pin so that they don't you know one may be lower one is higher and the next one may be in the middle or somewhere so that you space out the wires in between them so that they don't to prevent them from touching each other so I think that's the best way to do it and I'll just take it to the front I'm not sure whether this is the front or not but this is a short pin side so like I mentioned in my previous video the best thing to do is not to solder here because you may accidentally burn this component so anyway once this is done use the heat shrink that has been provided or if they forget to provide it to you just get your own heat shrink, cut it into a size and then just slide it over your module and it's going to be like this so it will be cleaner so I hope you enjoy watching this uh, explanation of how to solder the wires onto the module 
So I'm going to move on to my next video. So until next video, this is JT Gravity RC signing out.